Oh, glorious. Thank you very much, Fai. Thank you for the resub, and thank you for staying fantastic. And, um, yeah, got a TV advantage here. A big one with the two journeymen. 1550. 340 gap. He's got 11 players. Two Dodgers. 2 1 1. Obviously, we've got 11 players. A wrestle tackle. No mighty blow tackle, sadly, anymore. So, this might be a good match to skill these up, except that he's been a wizard and he's got elves. So, yeah, time to get diced. <laughs> I'm not on TV now. <laughs> <laughs> Nonsense. Maybe he's a fan of them. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> oh, shit. It is a classic video. It is a classic. Maybe he's a, f a fan of, um, what's it? What's it called? Brass Eye. Nons Nonsense. That was brilliant, wasn't it? <laughs> Nothing bad has happened, that's true. That's true. Can all skull. I should just steal that emote and call it Jim Surf, shouldn't I? That seems like a good idea. I'm surprised he's allowed to use that because it's like official Games Workshop, isn't it? He could get with an old rule, yeah. Maybe he should. And to be fair, 2 on one's actually pretty decent with um, high elves, isn't it? Oh, bribe. Dirty Dingo. I've only got 11 players. Dirty Dingo. <laughs> Yeah, VGP is beaten. Wouldn't be that bad. Someone asked it on my on my YouTube who is who is VGP. I'm new. <laughs> I'm new. What's VGP? <laughs> Pretty good. This dirty dingo will lose. That's what I'd like to see. Taking a while, isn't it? Mm. Oh god, it's heat. Oh, dicing incoming. Oh. <laughs> Time to get diced indeed. Oh no, heat. <laughs> ah! <laughs> Do you know what? I might just go with the weather dome just to never get fucked by heat. Because heat is probably the most game deciding thing, isn't it? And at least like with Throw a Rock, if you if you've got the better team, like better record, you've usually got the fame. And the same with pitch invasion. Pitch invasion isn't even bad for L's anyway. It's pretty much always good when you get a pitch invasion, even if you get more guys knocked down than they do. There's more space, isn't there? And um, more, more chances.
<laughs> oh man. Could do the four plus surf. Wouldn't even be bad because put it with a sidestepper on the line. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Like, it's the sort of thing I'd maybe do against, you know, Ducky or Inarian if they set up like that. Because then the, then the risk is worth the reward, isn't it? But, um, you know, hopefully this guy's shit. <laughs> and, uh, <laughs> and it doesn't matter. He's on five. I guess he could, um, he could pick it up. This keeps the screen, doesn't it? Is this oh there's three people there, that's how I was like, why haven't I done this setup before? Oh that's why. If it's down the sideline it just just scores I guess. But this protects the this this could be the best setup against owls. Blitzing against blitzers. You can't find no. That's the worst thing about the um, the dome, isn't it? Is the fucking horrible, horrible graphics. Oh, thank God, thank God, it's not heat. Oh, holy shit, holy shit, thank God, it's not heat. Yeah, Kaz, brilliant. Not getting diced so far. I like that having the guard there doesn't mean that it means even if it's a push the next guy gets to make his block which, which is good. Oh well. Maybe I spoke too soon about not getting diced. Well, it was true for the first turn. Didn't get diced in the first turn. So at least they're like on the first action. <laughs> so maybe still getting diced on the first turn, but at least not on the first action. I kind of don't want to blitz because it would um it would expose somebody, wouldn't it? There's only wrestlers that can blitz. I guess could blitz that blitzer over there. So I can um, make it safe first. Making the ball safe. Keeping the ball safe. I actually want him up there, I don't want him to assist. Oh, now I've got bits with him. Oh, shit. Shit, fucked it. Obviously, he was the one that was going to blitz with Wrestle. And it was the witch was going to be protected. Not a, not a great start. Fuck. Oh, that one's Destiny. Thank you very much for the sub. Unfortunately, there's a bit of a problem with, um, with, the, uh, with the new subs beta and... Um, and Twitch alerts. So if you bear with me, um, well, not Twitch alerts anymore, it's Streamlabs. So if you bear with me, I shall replay that. And then, um. Glorious! Thank you very much, One's Destiny. For the sub and welcome to Team Fantastic. Oh yeah. <laughs> 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 
No, 100% those were his real thumbs. They were my real thumbs, but um, I moved them. I moved them from the picture to put to put them under there. <laughs> yeah, Kaz. <laughs> it was crazy, wasn't it? Kaz then double score, then pick the ball up and ring. It is. Uh... Look <laughs> at no excuse central. <laughs> they're not excuses, they're reasons. <laughs> reasons, they're not excuses. So yeah, good, he hits the, hits the defenseless, well, not the defenseless man, hits the loner, isn't he? All about making your opponents hit your, hit your loners, I think. I think that's one thing. From my games, when um, <laughs> when usually my opponent's blitzing journeyman, um, in fact, you can't possibly help it. much more than um, much more than I am in general. I think. I've got to blitz this one, haven't I? See, he's, uh, that stands him up. Well, I would have rather gone middle, but this gets him to stand up without rolling dice. Which is ideal. He's the one that gets hit, right? Rookie Blitzer. Makes it a bit harder if they stand together. Which is okay there. Ah. The reason machine. <laughs> <laughs> excuses for having excuses. Yeah. Yeah, in kind of a good move. Oh, wow, he was unlucky. Look at that. He hit the block and walked to the score. And then got down, downed himself on the wrestle anyway. Glorious. <laughs> oh, baby. Alright, is it is. Hello. Good morning, VIP. How's it Reason machine. There are reasons, though. You know, people are too too quick to cut. Oh, beg your pardon. Too quick to call things excuses when they're just actually reasons. Right, I'm gonna I'm gonna go down the side a little bit more here, just because it gets the air, uh, which is into play, doesn't it? Um, which is good. Which is good. Exposed to the wizard, I guess. I don't want to base anybody though. Just keep him based, even though it's a one in thirty six to dodge out. It's better than not having to dodge out. Isn't it? No, it's not an excuse for excuses. But because honestly, what's it called? My my friend, right, is is mum his mum has cancer, and she he says she's never used that as an excuse for not doing something. And I'm like, it would be a fucking reason, wouldn't it? <laughs> it's not. It's not. It's not an excuse. It's stupid, it's stupid to call it an excuse. Like, as far as reasons for, you know. I don't know, it's just stupid, isn't it? I don't know why people are obsessed by calling things excuses when they're just actually reasons, like, you know. I don't need an excuse for not for not fucking lifting lifting as heavily as Zadrunus Saviscus, do I? There's just a, there's reasons that I can't <laughs> lift as heavy as him. 
Yeah, you know, it's just I don't know. It just seems ridiculous. Why? Why people are obsessed with calling things excuses? <laughs> I'm not at all Carl Ancelotti, but if you know if she didn't feel like going, I don't know, walking somewhere, it wouldn't be an excuse, would it? It'd be a reason. Literally the same thing. Oh well, that's okay then. I used to I used to lift a little bit, um, but I'm I'm gonna get back into it big style soon. Right, I think I want to knock this guy down. I think I'm gonna go go man's. This is a one dice blitz if I hit them, so I'm gonna have to go this way. Oh shit, she's in the way though. Alright, we're gonna man's him a little bit. Oh man, Kaz. <laughs> Watch out, can you look at your star stuff? Holy shit. That's pretty funny. Um. I really hate going down one sideline. But the guard, the guard should make these guys a little bit safer, shouldn't it? Should try, I want to get back in the middle. The new Arnie, fantastic, yeah. Nevi's not Arnie. <laughs> yeah, fireball, I thought it might come. But I mean that—that's why he was here to kind of cover. He stuns the guard guy, the guard that was protecting him, getting too deep down. Got a pretty easy recovery, hasn't he? Unfortunately. Deadlifting kebabs. <laughs> nah, it's more curling kebabs, isn't it? <laughs> getting to do. Oh my God, he's rolled double goals again. Um. You get to do. You get to do curls when you eat a kebab. <laughs> concentration curls. <laughs> I like to. <laughs> you actually could do concentration curls to eat kebab. That's pretty good. Um, what skills? Definitely. Um, definitely dirty player. And. Um, I don't know, other things. Wild animal, yeah. <laughs> <sighs> it was a nice side step, though, wasn't it? Base the ball. Basing the ball, <laughs> you know, isn't terrible when it's to stop him picking it up. There's actually too many down players for him, really, isn't there? So now, now that the wizard's gone, movement nine is going to try and get it. Venue foul appearance. Wow, that's that's mean. It's pretty mean. This guy's getting surfed. Um, not really, actually. There's no way through, is there? Oh, and unfortunately, she can't block because it would be into a one D. I mean, she could block. Wouldn't be the end of the world, would it? I'm definitely not going to make a surf. Alright, roll the power anyway. Sweet. And. 
maybe blitz this this bastard. With armor seven. Given up blocks, so maybe, maybe mans him a little bit to um, yeah, I don't want to She can stand up, he can come over here, he can stand up and be in a cage, a full cage. So, what does he do? There, I guess. Guess gotta re roll this pick up. Mm -hmm. Didn't even fail it. Outrageous. Oh, you're talking about yourself. That's that's just as bad. That's still it's still. Take hey, root. You don't wrestle. <laughs> what the fuck's this? <laughs> oh my god. This has gone to a dark place, this, isn't it? <laughs> um, oh my god, have you seen the movie, a Serbian film? It's pretty bad. It disturbed me, which, um, which takes some doing. Let me tell you. I don't know about the skills, I think a lot of them are, you know, because when you think a human lineman, you know, people, people always say stuff like, um, you know, I was really, I was a really fast runner in college and stuff and, uh, you know, I was, I was a fucking collegiate wrestler, so I'd get wrestling all this kind of stuff, or I'm a badass at B-Strength 4, but when you think, it just, it just depends how the average lineman is in the NFL, isn't it? Um, in the in like blood bowl, because if a lineman in the NFL is like a contemporary, let's say rugby professional rugby player, <laughs> then nobody's getting any skills. <laughs> and just everyone's just being like fucking I don't know five three two seven or something. So it just depends, doesn't it? I should have gone for the pickup with one of the blitzers to get them skilled because I can't hand off to them. Maybe it's the turnover score will be a little. I really don't want to risk the turnover. The turnover. And like obviously you want to have the ball in fucking movement nine dodge guy, don't you? If the if the if the score is in doubt <laughs> You don't want it carrying on a movement seven, no dodge guy. Go re could move really far over here. It's so amazing being at movement nine, isn't it? Even though even though the reason that some people like orc throwers and think they don't need movement is you can't outrun is because they would outrun their protection if they were faster which is one of the dumbest things i've heard um it's good being movement nine isn't it it's actually good being movement nine I 
Can everyone get out? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So it looks like. Ah. Uh, Yeah, it looks like I can't go further than that. <laughs> he could use his bride, yeah. <laughs> right, scoring threat. Canoring threat is coming straight in there. Maybe I should base these guys, because he's only got the one reroll. Got guard. Could stick two guys in there, and it's a little bit hard to deal with. Three players taken up. Seems reasonable. Split my own team for him, but obviously, Blodge and. Blodge can Blodge can all then um, get back into the fight. Yeah, everyone would mostly be peasants, wouldn't they? But even then, even then, like, <laughs> yeah, they would be peasants, wouldn't they? Because you, if you were a Bretonian knight and you were making your Blood Bowl team, you would want the best peasants, wouldn't you? You would like hold tryouts and stuff, and you would get the um, you would get like the least. The least shit peasants, which is would would be any normal person with with any fucking physical ability, wouldn't it? <laughs> yeah, so I guess everyone would be kind of peasants. Yeah, six three two seven would be would be fair for an average person, I guess. Got him. Gonna base the ball. Is tackle an optional skill? No, but there's no real need for it to be optional because dodge should be optional, shouldn't it? So. Essentially, every time you wouldn't want to, um, every time you wouldn't want to use tackle, your opponent could just not use dodge. So, he's totally basing the ball. He's not even going to. It wouldn't even mean that bad because it's a loner, isn't it? So, basing the ball wouldn't have even been that bad there. And now, I guess he's going to make some two plus rolls. I don't hate this defense though, it's not bad. I mean I guess he's given up the surf on his um on his high on his blitzer there, his blood blitzer can get surfed. If I want. And with movement nine I don't even need to move forward this time. So I could think about making that surf. No, the only reason for skills not being optional is um, is like ease of programming and speed of play are really the only reasons to not make things optional. Yeah, obviously frenzy isn't. Um, right, so could blitz there with the witch and then like clear them. Um, And then just run through this, so that seems good, doesn't it? At least the push. And then everyone runs through here, and then. The only bad thing is she's got fucking wrestle, isn't it? Oh, God. 
disgusting. It's so it's fucking disgusting, isn't it? Being movement seven, movement seven, movement nine. Even. Got to run a dark elf. Seems good. Yeah, Mighty Blow. Oh, when would you want to not use Mighty Blow or Dirty Player? Well, Dirty Player should be optional when you've got Sneaky Git. Mighty Blow could be optional because if you were playing somebody in the playoffs... No, sorry. If you were playing somebody who's playing your rivals in the, in the next game, you might want to take a KO in the second half and not cast them. But, like, it's really, really unlikely that you wouldn't want to use Claws or Mighty Blow. Um... Yeah, exactly. Like block, block is should be optional because you know you could not use it because let's say you had a guy here and he got put got there was two players here and he got blocked by the first guy and it was a both down. You could not use block to get knocked over so you don't get surfed by the second guy and stuff like that. Um, also, also trees to get unrooted might not want to use block. But realistically, block. You know, this it's just it's just ease of use, isn't it? <laughs> Blitz is faster than two dwarves in a relay race. <laughs> yeah, that's true. He's really fast. Yeah, that's true, Carl Ancelotti. Yeah, dark elf team with a movement nine guy does seem better than better than generic chaos team. Yeah, exactly. Chain pushing as well. A one turn attempt, you know, a one turn attempt. If you, if your opponent just rolls a board down, but has has made like say maybe he's made a quick snap, and um, or something like that, or just rolls a board down, and maybe has another chance to get the push they need. You wouldn't want to use block then. I mean, it's rare that you're not going to want to use block though. It's so rare. That The dodge was a five, so it didn't matter that um, I hadn't closed the thing off just to get that guy in a bit forward. Right, could make a surf, maybe? Yeah, this guy. And him, but that, mid that would need a dodge, wouldn't it? Which um, I don't really want to make. Well, this need I just need a GFI, so neither of them get surfed. Um, could chain her out to get this surf it's possible I'm pretty sure I wouldn't miss the handoff, not even if it wasn't raining. Fuck. So wanna so wanna re-roll that to surf this guy, but nah. Not not gonna risk one in thirty-six things. I'm definitely not one in that. No, but even if it wasn't raining, I don't, know. I don't mind getting more star player points on him.
I guess the wrestle guy goes on the line just because he's minus movement. Already. You never know, he might he might have a clue how to one turn. But down to nine players already, that's pretty good, isn't it? Pretty lucky. Yeah, I might go sprint. I might go sprint after the sidestep, but yeah, sidestep would be here? amazing. Man. What are you doing? Ah. <laughs> Batman being amazing. I think sprint just just because the sheer power of it, isn't it? Like sure it's unreliable, but maybe sure because he's gonna be. I guess he's gonna be the ball carrier most of the time. It's it's tough though between sure hands, sure feet, and sprint, isn't it? God, if you got agility five, God, that'd be amazing, wouldn't it? I guess I'll pl play this team until he dies. <laughs> I guess is the, is the thing, isn't it? And then the thing is, it's going to be harder to qualify with this dark elf team than it is with the chaos team. But yeah, obviously, dark elves with a one turn. Seems much more powerful than generic chaos team number twenty-seven. Wow! Well, notorious noob who's who's in the top spot already has has two strength four um, things. Ah, oh, there you go. So, execute. Oh my god! So get a touch back. <laughs> And execute a perfect drive and, and then get rioted on. So he's got a chance. Isn't that disgusting? That's what I hate about bash teams. This might be tough now. There might have to be elf things happening. I guess oh, I was going to say the good thing is the win, but he got a touchback anyway. But if he does a pass play, at least it's a 1 in 9 thing. Really annoying, isn't it? Holy shit! Didn't even give it the throw. <laughs> oh, he's on five, so he wants to do a fucking pass with a three plus catch. Well, I'm an absolute madman not giving it to his throw. Deserves to lose. He's been pretty unlucky, hasn't he? Rolling double skulls. Well, I guess I rolled two double skulls too. Um. But he's on down TV, so he's the one that needs to be lucky. Kind of wasted his wizard, really. And um, hasn't used his bribe. And obviously the random removals. I've probably made more blocks than him, but... <laughs> yeah, perfect situation for a vanity. <laughs> Absolute madman. Turnover. Oh, and injured himself on me. Oh shit! Don't know. <laughs> Dickhead. <laughs> right, that's pretty good. So obviously we'll. Put, oh shit! Bloodstep. I can't reach him. So Bloodstep has to go on him. And then everyone surrounds this one. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eight. So I've got to hit from that direction, right? So he goes there. I guess I should have done an elf screen. Like 
somewhere. Still score one, two, three, four, five. Yeah. Kabom. Can he chain it out somehow? Yeah, look at him. Move it. Well, of course, not not lucky in the end, but um, fantastic play. <laughs> he can blitz him, put a guy there, blitz him, push him to there. So maybe put him there. Now he just gets the two plus dodge out, so I have to put him in there. GFI. Because he's moving five, of course. I guess I should put him there, and then that would have been a screen right. Hopefully that's enough. <laughs> yeah, vastly superior. <laughs> Not just fantastic. <laughs> vastly superior. <laughs> there might be an easy way to, to score here as well. That's the thing. I should have maybe thought more. And done stuff, but... It seems relatively tough, doesn't it? It's only a four plus two plus outlaw. <laughs> maybe should have put him there, but then it was then it was the blitz out was easy. So maybe should have put another guy in the front there. But then it would relied on him dodging out. It's tough. It's tough to do, isn't it? I mean, it's just a three plus two plus for him. Fucking stupid elves, man. Fucking elves. Basically, it doesn't even matter what. Um, hello, Dr. Mom Bosco. Um, yeah. Happy, mostly. Mostly happy. Oh, shit. Oh, look. Now there's no tackle on this guy. Wrestle's good, isn't it? Also, if I had block, I would have just blocked down this fucking catcher. One of, like, Wrestle's a bit shit, isn't it? Wrestle has yet to be good on this witch. Oh, it's so shit that he's just got to roll some dice and there's just nothing... Nothing you can actually do to stop him, is there? Because he's out. Uh, completely got a ride. Rain probably saved us there. Maybe I should take them both down just to guarantee getting them down. Maybe. Maybe that was a misplay there. Maybe I should have been punished. Why are you what are you doing here? What are you doing? <laughs> ah. I guess I want to stop this guy scoring completely right because he's got eight players. I can't stop him. Should do. Safe throw was involved, yeah. Yeah. Intercepted it, but then he, he safe throwed it. Pass was a three, catch was a two, reeled into a three, so thank God the rain 
actually saved that play. Unbelievable, eh? Yeah, the Batman is completely amazing. <laughs> yeah. yeah, the Fast Diamond. I can't believe he's tried to claim. Claim the Ziggurat as the Fast Diamond. Crazy guy. Crazy cat. Gotta try to stop this, I don't know. I think I think it work. Could even maybe score quickly if I get the turn over. He's down to eight players. He hasn't played bad, but he's played new, hasn't he? Like it, the obsessive screening that didn't really achieve much. And uh, but he he made the right play to score, definitely. I think, well, he whiz, he wizarded badly, I think. I think it was a bad wizard. And, uh, obviously, he shouldn't have probably chosen the bribe due to the fact that he hasn't fouled it all. Fash has indeed invented everything in Blood Bowl, hasn't he, Fash? He's invented everything and everything. This old Fash. Oh man, huge pickup. No, he hasn't really, no, BZL. I mean, and, and that was the thing, he was never likely to, was he? In like an elf on elf battle, it's all about positioning, isn't it? And um, and giving it up just to foul somebody isn't, isn't such a good move. Usually. He has got his kick guy now, though, can make a two assist foul. Relatively painless, but that's the thing, isn't it? If he, if he is. Now he's down players, it gets even harder to foul. Like, Bribe's one of those things where it, it's good if everything goes right, but it's shit if everything goes wrong, isn't it? That's why I tend to, even with a bash team, tend to go with an apple. <laughs> um. And guard against what's likely to happen rather than like it's almost win more, isn't it? If you get the foul. Fashion at Albi. Oh man, what a dirty dingo. Is he in range? He might he might be. He can base them. <laughs> Fucking movement nine. I guess he'll catch people out of the movement nine guy. Um because people think they won't be able to be based, but he'd be like moment nine, and he'd just be like bosh or blitzed. It makes the, it makes the um, dark elf team a lot better on a blitz as well, doesn't it? And you can just go nine and catch the ball like a good runner. Yeah, he's getting the two assist foul in. This is probably the first time he's been able to foul, but and like he wouldn't have made that foul if he didn't have the bribe. But then he would have been. He would have been standing in a better spot if he hadn't. That's the thing, isn't it? Maybe. Right? Does he go? I'm not. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna go for it. Um, but I am gonna. I fucking stand him there, like a badass. Oh god, it's tackle. I did the wrong thing. And I've done it doubly wrong. Alright, just roll the pal. That seemed good.
let's see what happens here. Come on, come on. <laughs> I'm not... Yeah, you know, but that's the thing, isn't it? I mean, if... Uh, I guess... Yeah, I guess I shouldn't use him most of the time. You're right. He's just in movement 9, so... If he overcommits, like if you move a movement seven guy up with dot, like if I just threatened with this guy, I don't know. It's it's super easy to deal with, isn't it? But with this guy as well, it's just better. Than that. Yeah, scroll dude, it's unbelievable, isn't it? And uh, VIP scroll dude, Sunday stream. Um, just because I've got to play the games to fucking qualify. Yeah, only the strong survive. <laughs> I mean, my record isn't that good that I can afford to play super passively, is it? I still got to try to win games um, due to that loss. Block, get knocked down. Seems reasonable. I mean, I'm not even. I'm not even whining there. It does actually seem reasonable, doesn't it? <laughs> it's what I expect every time I give up a block. I expect my guy to be removed. Tackle doing a thing, maybe. Yep. Oh, burning a rear. I guess he's got four. Dirty dingo. So the question is swarm the cage or. Mark the catcher, I guess. I just mark the catcher. Mark the gnawing threats. And go into the cage with X amount of stuff. Safe moves first, though. Just for fash. Is this a GFI to hit? Oh, no. Obviously, facing the ball, but with blood stare. Not, not more on it. And while the rest of his cage is based apart from this guy. And his receivers are covered. Obviously got the big man advantage. Well, it's only two players at the moment. I do like Frenzy. I do like Frenzy on a strength ball or blitzer. Um, so, yeah. Definitely go frenzy. 
I got I got actually movement movement strength frenzy guy um upwards on my on my good orc team. In a while, isn't it? Well, I guess it's not easy. Oh, dirty dingo, he did the dodges. And a blots. One dice blots. It's pretty much a dirty dingo at this point, isn't it? Roll the one, <laughs> basing the ball, and then it's gone. He's passing it. Is he in range? Let me see. He's doing a lot of good. Hmm. Movement 9 can pick it up. But then she would be in a frenzy trap. He could blitz, but needs someone to assist. He could do it. Power's bludger. Seems good. Yes, he's got a dodge to there. She's got to tag him with dodge. In that case, he could have gone somewhere else. Right, one in thirty-six. It's worth it, isn't it? Oh, 
baby. And I guess he can just stand there. I mean, he could dodge away and then make it really safe, but I think it's okay, even though I want to do. I think he was pretty much fucked, yeah? Maybe he's just passed to the, uh, passed to the catcher and then try to score. Yes, pass should absolutely be optional, yeah. It's so bad that, you, that you've that you got to take, you're more likely to fumble with pass, basically, a lot of times. Yeah, it was a very bad spot, I don't know. I could watch the VOD back and see what could happen, but I guess it would be um, pass to the catcher, or try to like make a cage somewhere else. I mean, like, he, could, he, was, he was almost busting out a cage there. You know, they have taken some two pluses, but we could have done it. I just wanted the ball in the hands, so now I can definitely hand off to him. One nil up. Once the once the catch is taken care of. And like there's a big enough cage to risk a one nine. Definitely go for the handoff. Because got to got to skill up these blitzers. Yeah, a lot a lot of the time, not always, but a lot of the time, it's gonna make you more. Or maybe it will always make you more likely to fumble. Maybe it's not all the time. No, not all the time. Not on a two plus pass. But um, if you like, if you have four plus, if you say it's a four plus pass, um, normal, you know, if if you roll a two or a three, you don't use pass and have an inaccurate pass but then you know you might be happy with it. Or like, let's say you need a let's see let's say you needed a six plus for it. Let let's say it was a let's say you needed a six plus pass. You could just um and you rolled a five and it was minus four <laughs> so you fumble minus if it was minus three to the roll. Six was accurate, five is inaccurate, one to four is a fumble. If you've got pass, you're more like you like it's just horrible because you know you roll the five and then you use pass and you fumble and stuff. But I mean that that's the most obvious way of looking at it. The most obvious example. Yeah, inaccurate fail pass there, isn't it? So I guess try to try to hit him with a rackle. Because he's got dodge and I don't like it when people have dodge. <laughs> Get a really big, get a really big cage going here.
really hope I don't want a nine now. Good lad. Caught out with that wrestle playing clicker games. But it's okay. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> exactly. Is it fun fox? As if that's even an argument that people have, you can outrun your cage. Like how anyone can say that the, the minus MA isn't a factor for a ball carrier. Holy shit. Well, inaccurate any field passes just isn't a fumble, is it? Yeah. One because if you've got a minus one tackle zone. <laughs> Which team would you prefer qualifying white dark elves? Yeah, the dark elves have got to be the best one to qualify with. Just because, um... Oh god, he has to get a card. Just because they're, um... They're more interesting, aren't they? They're more interesting. They're more powerful. Um, having, having, um, having movement nine is, is ridiculous, isn't it? I guess you want to protect my positionals. Apart from this guy who wants to get a cars. Shit that it's raining. Not enough time to score and then turn him over and score again. Exactly, <laughs> yeah, exactly, blue and hippie. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, the air is garbage. Yeah, that's the thing, even if you have to move, it's, it's so stupid. Yeah, that's the thing, isn't it? Like, the Chaos team at the moment is just a generic Chaos team. But it's going to be easier for the Chaos team to qualify, record wise. Um, but the Dark Elves, I like moving that. I just can't believe Super strong being movement 9. <laughs> Having a movement 9 go, even. So he's not even trying to stop, but there's not going to be time to turn him over and score again. So better to give up less blocks. Maybe you hit this guy, that'd be a GFI. Oh, well played by the way, you're killing it. Thanks. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, 
I'd obviously love to get the completion on him and the completion on him, but it's just not going to happen this game in the fucking round, is it? That is, that is just sad, sad reality that it's not going to happen this game. Run round, hit him. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Risking a one in thirty-six. Just to hit the armor. <laughs> the armor seventh guy. Oh man, KO. It wasn't even because of his armor. Shit. Would have been pretty happy if that had been because of his armor. Might as well re-roll it, even though he's alive. Oh, baby. <laughs> he might as well have another another stomp attempt. No reason not to whistle at this stage. It's all a bit of fun. Mindless fouling. Yeah, mighty blow. I mean, had the mighty blow tackler, but he, he got fucking killed. Um, but yeah, definitely, obviously need that. But I mean, rolling doubles um, isn't that unlikely, is it, in the future? Uh, there's plenty of time to roll doubles on one of the other blitzes. So I'm not too too sad that there isn't a mighty blow at the moment. And um, in terms of playoffs. Yeah, that's true, but hit the yes, not. That's not a bad idea. I'm Batman. I right, get a foul in here. I fell just as much as him, nearly, without a drive. Pretty funny. What are you, what are you doing here? What are you doing? Ah. Yeah, wrestle down for the foul. Yeah, wrestle is a bit bad sometimes, isn't it? But. The important thing is against L. He's a journeyman, though. Good. Thank God. I thought that seems that seems realistic. Uh, that was a good thing, wasn't it? They the, uh, they were on the ends. The, um, the journeyman were on the ends. Maybe I shouldn't have fouled with the journeyman. I should have put, put the journeyman there and fouled with him. I guess that was a misplay. Oh, that's good. He did do his job fantastically well. Um, okay, he's punching him there. Three, four, five, six. Just too far away to 
guy's tough, man. three I guess oh. <laughs> that was why not to 70k no it was, it was two lime it's still two lime um, I guess I don't buy anybody because I've got 150 wow back girl was the MVP really good really good MVP Tackle, then I guess a lodge step tackle. It's the only real choice, but still, two tacklers now, two two frenzy tacklers, is pretty good. And um, yeah, when I go over 150, I'll buy the uh, buy the tenth guy again. Um, so not bad. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe and stay fantastic.